Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Jill with At Home with Jill. And as you can see, I am decluttering my horrid bedroom in this video. Um, so this is still kind of after Christmas clutter because I never got to this room in my last video. Um, and all these boxes and stuff are from Christmas and there's like stockings on the floor and there's just still a lot of Christmas stuff in here. So here I am finally tackling this room. I'm going to deep clean this room today, get everything out from under my bed, really clean everything. So stay tuned and also don't forget to subscribe for more cleaning and decluttering motivation coming up. So I normally have two more decoration pillows on my bed that match the duvet cover, but I had to use the pillow inserts for my son's new bedding, so I need to buy two more um, just like regular standard pillows to put those pillow shams back on. Um, so that's why it looks all weird and flat right now. So I'm planning on doing a video soon sharing my tips on how to get started on cleaning and decluttering an overwhelmingly messy house that you just don't know where to start. And you can apply it to your whole house or just one room or whatever. Um, it's just how to basically go from what my room just looked like to clean quickly and not so super like overwhelmingly stressed out. Falling 
Jumping from cliffs so high Trusting our wings to fly Sometimes we're crashing down But we get up and start from the ground Okay, you guys, so I like to have the least amount of things on the floor as possible because then I can't clean behind the things. Like over there is driving me crazy because Aubrey's present has been hiding there. I think I'm gonna stick it up there. You guys, I bought this on impulse from someone. I went to her house to buy a rocking chair and I saw this in her garage and I bought it. <laughs> I have not been able to attach it to the wall and I've been regretting my purchase ever since, but I decided that I'm gonna make a shelf. It might go right there. I'm kind of debating just getting rid of it. I haven't even printed pictures for it, actually. My mom just happened to give me some, a stack of pictures and I just put them up there. So I haven't even printed pictures for this thing yet. Oh. I could put it on this wall right when you walk into my bedroom. This is the perfect wall. It's nice and wide and tall and blank. You would see pictures when you walked in, which would be nice, right? So for now, it's gonna go in that corner. If you guys remember, this mirror was in that corner and um, I wanted it back up here because I, I liked how I used to have that. Um, I'm gonna put my sewing machines away as soon as I sew these hooded towels that I'm gonna make. And then I was thinking of putting this desk in the girls' room once I clean their room. And then you guys, over here, this is my husband's corner, you guys, and I can't declutter his stuff. I'm gonna ask him very politely, again, because I have multiple times, if he can please put these in the workshop. You guys, all of our problems would be solved if we had a garage, right? Most people have a garage for this type of stuff. Um, and then these are his bins. So like his wetsuit is up there. He has all his junk in there that's like he uses whatever. These are for shooting, like headphones, like earphones for shooting. These are his pants. These are my pants. And that bin, I can probably declutter. I don't know what's in there, honestly. So I should, I should open that up and declutter it. And then also what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take everything out from under my bed and declutter it. I'm gonna do that right now. Okay guys, so out of everything that was under my bed, that is like a storage bag for like blankets or something. I'm not gonna get rid of that yet. Um, that's just a roll of trash bags. That's not gonna be here. That's the trash bag that I filled up. I'm gonna donate these curtains finally. I just, when I pulled them down from there, I just shoved them under my bed. So I'm gonna donate those. Um, that's my husband's it's filled with like receipts and stuff. So that's gonna go back on his side I'm gonna put it in his nightstand though. Okay, so donate donate um, This bin I'm obviously gonna see Let me put this in there I'm gonna see if I need those for anything um, That's wood that's gonna go to the workshop that is a Kiwi Co craft thing that I forgot my friend sent me um, for Stella to do. So I'm gonna put that in our school stuff so she can do that soon. Um, these are jeans. These are jeans that I'm saving. That I have a feeling they might fit me again. Um, now that I am like gluten free and not eating all the foods that I was um, sensitive to and that were causing all my like gut issues. 
Okay, and then that is a stack of stuff that's going into our loft storage area. So like there's a bin of baby clothes that I'm like that bring back memories. Um, the little cookie container is something my grandma left for me when she passed away. These are the baby clothes. This is just um, a coloring thing that my daughter wants me to save. Um, this is what I'm talking about, you guys. Did everyone's grandma have this or what? This was filled with all her sewing stuff. Um, hold on, it's filled with like sewing stuff. Oh, and there's a hot glue gun. I'll take that out and leave that in my school stuff. But yeah, so that's just gonna go up in our loft storage because I don't need it under my bed. And then that is my old Care Bear record player. I cannot get rid of this yet, you guys. If I can find affordable records to buy, I'm gonna give this to my kids. Um, so yeah, loft, 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 loft. That is a bin of user manuals. That's gonna go in my laundry room because it has like the manuals for our washing machine, dryer, dishwasher, like all that kind of stuff. So that's gonna go in my laundry room. I don't know why it was in here. Um, this was uh, this was a bin of my son's Lego instructions, which he never builds the Lego sets, you guys. After he builds the set once, he takes them apart and makes his own creation. So I don't know why I've been saving the instructions. So I got rid of them, they're in the trash. That is gonna hold our colored pencils, which are just emptied out into a drawer right now because the box broke. So I'm excited because actually I'm not putting any of this stuff back under my bed. I'm gonna put those in one of my bins over there and all the other stuff is basically leaving my room. So let me get going on that. My life was great till you added color. Okay, so now I'm just gonna put that table leaf under my bed and that will be the only thing under my bed. Okay, and it's nice and centered under there so when you walk in my room, you don't see a bunch of junk under there anymore and I am so happy with how that ended up. Oh yeah, there was one more bin I wanted to declutter. My life was great till you added colors. Like the moon is the sun, we don't care about the others. You set my world on. Okay. So I'm excited that I found this CD. It's this um, Sunday School Songs. This is a super fun CD to listen to in the car for kids. Um, it's like, I am a C, I am a C-H, I am a C-H-R-I-S-T-I-A-N. So anyway, it's all those fun Christian songs for little kids. And then um, the rest here I'm getting rid of. So this is a cowgirl hat that I just had to have. I begged Rich to buy it for me and I barely ever wore it. It's just getting ruined and all smashed up in here. So I'm gonna donate that. Um, these are just old gift bags that I didn't even know were in there. This is a dress that my mom gave me. Doesn't look right on me. Um, a hose faucet thing. Don't need that. This is um, an old purse, another old purse, and an old shirt. And those are my mother-in-laws, so I'm gonna give those back to her. They're for rolling coins.
Okay guys, so now I am just cleaning my room and I am still loving the Branch Basics, you guys. So I used the All Purpose on my dresser and now I'm using the Streak Free on my mirror. Um, I love this stuff, seriously. If you guys didn't catch my first video about it, it's just you get this bottle of concentrate and you just mix the concentrate with water and the different bottles tell you what levels to fill things at. So like for the streak free one for windows and mirrors, you just fill it mostly up with water and then you just use like a drop of the concentrate. And this stuff seriously is amazing you guys. I am loving it. And I have a coupon code for you guys so I will put that here on the video and I will put the link in the description along with the coupon code so you guys can go check it out and see if you're interested. Um, so yeah, I am loving the branch basics, you guys. Move a little closer without letting him see. My hands are shaking from the urge of being with him. I act a little dumber when I try to get his number. I'm so nervous that I'm losing grip of myself. Ah, my body's giving up on me. Cause I don't know what to do with my fingertips. Ah, I want to run through his hair, but don't stare. I get a little starstruck when I see you. Like 90 degrees, it's making me hot, and he has the same effect on me. I act a little.